Hey guys, what's up? It's me. I'm back with another drumming video. I moved my hi-hat out of the way. It's way over here, but it was right in front of the camera. But I moved it so that you can see my snare. So, um, this is my new snare head. This is not an entirely new drum, but it's a ambassador, a coated ambassador, 14 inch on the top, and a regular ambassador on the bottom. And before they were the exact same heads, so these are just improved of the same head. So I'm going to turn the snare off so you can hear it, what it sounds like uh, without the head or without the snares. I think it's making that sound because of where I placed it, the drum. I don't know why it's making that kind of rubbing sound, but if I take off the snare weight, it's very echoey. So, yeah, but it sounds good. And if I put the snare on, it sounds... You can kind of hear the buzzing. Well, if I put a beanbag on the drum... No more buzzing. It's still echoey, and sometimes when I hit this mid-tom right here, it moves the snares under here. That's kind of annoying, but it honestly just kind of adds a new sound. It's kind of like a whoosh, kind of like a weird crash sound. But yeah, it sounds really good. So, So yeah, uh, it sounds really good, and uh, yeah, Christmas is coming up, so, and the drum, I just want to replace the drum, get a whole new drum, so uh, hopefully I get a new snare drum for Christmas. I'm looking at a black one that is 8 inches, so it's very deep. This one is 5.5 inches. Uh, I like the really deep ones, that's just my personal taste. I like the, the really big ones, so yeah. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I will see you all l either later today or tomorrow because I have a, re a review coming out so uh, of something. I can't tell you now, but yeah. Uh, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Ah, bye.